guys, it's Anna. Um, I just wanted to do a little update. I had a couple requests, so I'm going to do this really quick. Um, first off, I just wanted to show you, I have a bunch of succulents here that I got as gifts. And here is, um, I think it's called the Rat Tail Cactus Pam. It is doing wonderful. It's putting out new growth all over. So excited about that. And here's a little guy that I got from Brittany. It's um, a cute little red stapalia or um, something. It's got a bunch of other blooms. It's a really good bloomer. I didn't think I was gonna get a bloom off of it that size. Um, some of the uh, other stuff going on around here. Um, the Zygo. Um, Ayana, you sent me that. It's doing, it's pushing off a new growth. I'm really happy. Um, but back to the point. Let's get into the flasks. So, I have found that if I leave the thing, like, mostly off, they seem to be fine. I did have a weird experience. I have found, um, three moths, dead moths. They're all covered with mold in here. Um, there are some plants that I need to take out. Um, it did get completely mold cover because I had it in such a high humidity level, but you can see that one's putting off a new leaf. That wasn't there before. I'm gonna kill all these things because I'm doing this one-handed. Um, so that's that one. That one was the pink. That's the one that's a really slow grower. Here's one that I have just by itself and I put the lid on all the way and it completely molded over. So I just kind of leave it like that. I gotta give this back anyways. Um, here's another one. It's doing pretty good. Um, it did get some mold down there, but that's also the black agar. Um, they all seem to be doing pretty well. I haven't really lost any that I can tell. Maybe the little, little guys that were on the side that the mold kind of attacked to, and then, um, here we go. The one that I did with you guys is doing perfectly fine. Um, still, yeah, it's throwing off a new leaf on that one right there. You can see it, so itty bitty bitty. So I'm pretty happy. I think um, either this month or next month, because it has been about a month since I've gotten these, that um, I'm going to put them in compote pots together and kind of separate out ones that are a little smaller. Um, let me try to get you in here. So, so you can see that there was some damage, like down there. I think I lost maybe one right here, but um, everything's been doing really well. I think it was just the humidity level um, on the moss or something wasn't that well. So this is basically how I store them. I just have them. This is like a really low light shelf. Um, I was thinking of getting one of those like uh, blue or violet lights to kind of simulate artificial light. Um, I just don't know where to hook it up. I guess I would just like poke holes. This is just real cheap plastic. Um, so yeah, I just want to do that update for you guys. Well, that is it. I love you so much family and I will talk to you later.